I choose to go hard and straight at spares, but I know, Brad, you uh, really go the 369 method for shooting your spares. I do, Parker. Uh, I like the 369 method. For those of you that are familiar with that, you know what we're talking about. For those of you that have never heard of the 369 method, wherever you're standing, that is point A. Wherever you're looking on the lane, wherever you're targeting, that's point B. Let's say you're lined up and you're throwing some good shots and getting some strikes. And for you right-handers, let's say you leave a two-pin. Off of point A, you'll want to move three boards opposite the pin and then use point B as your target. Repeat the same shot you did for your first shot. If you leave the four pin, that would be two zones to the left of the pocket. So you would move two zones to the right with your point A, thus six boards to the right. And then obviously for the seven pin, that would be three zones to the left. Therefore, you would move three zones to the right. Keeping in mind that you don't want to change your strike target. Obviously, if you leave the three pin, you would move three boards to the left and still use your strike target, which we determined as point B. All right, now you'll see that I have a four pin spare. What I'll want to do is off of my starting position, I'll want to move two zones opposite the pin two zones because the four pin is two zones away from the head pin. Thus, two times three boards for each move is six boards. Now, the important thing is to repeat the shot that I just did, still using my strike target like before. And that's the 369 method.